Hey guys, and welcome to today's vlog. This part is actually not part of the vlog. I just wanted to hop in here before Ellie has an awesome time with the kids and give you guys some quick updates and information. First thing that's probably the most important. I just bought my Halloween costume. It is amazing. I want you to guess and tweet me or Instagram me what you think my Halloween costume is and also what you are going to be for Halloween or what your kids are gonna be for Halloween. I would love to hear all about that. The second thing that I would like to talk to you about is Ellie and I have a weekly podcast that is out right now. Our first episode back is available. It just launched last week and we sit down and we talk about things um, that are important to our daily life. One thing in particular, something that is revolving around my heart. My heart has been having some trouble and I talk about that in depth on the podcast and it's pretty scary given my family history. So that is a note for you there. We also have some new podcasts coming out this Wednesday with some special guests. So our podcast will be coming out every Wednesday. I'm not exactly sure what time because it varies based on distribution, but look out for the podcast on Wednesday. Last but certainly not least, we have the Griffiths Cookbook. Those are going quickly, so if you guys want to get the Griffiths Cookbook for holidays, for Christmas presents, for anything like that, be sure to check it out sooner rather than later. I'll have a link down below to GriffithsCookbook.com where you guys can order them now. All of that being said, thank you so much for tuning in to the news update featuring Jared Meekum. That's me. Now on to the vlog. Are you ready to see Toy Story 4? I'm ready to see Duke Boom. Duke Boom. I know. I love you so much, buddy. <laughs> Can I have a kiss? I know. Jackson will be done soon, okay? All right. While my kids eat some Happy Meals in the front yard on the grass, my goal is to at least pick up the car. I got a speeding ticket the other day. I'm a hot mess. I have a lot of stuff to pick up. Oh my gosh, I picked up some of it so it doesn't look as bad, but I promise my car is a disaster. All right, I don't think I've officially said a good morning to you guys yet. I just picked up the camera and started going. You guys saw Calvin saying goodbye to Jared. He was very sad. Jared and Jackson are filming and I just thought it was a little busy and overwhelming. So I wanted to get home and let them work and me just do a few things here at the house. So we went from cleaning out our car, which was a crazy hot mess, and eating McDonald's to <laughs> making a list of things that I need to go grocery shopping. I'm using the cookbook that we created and I'm going to enjoy, not that I don't always enjoy, but I'm gonna try and focus on not worrying about like things that I need to get done and focus on the kids. So right now I just unloaded the car and I made a little grocery list. So I'm gonna take the two boys with me and I'm gonna run some errands. So tonight I think I'm gonna try and do something special with Calvin. You know, even as small as just watching a movie and making popcorn together. So I think that's what I'm gonna do with Calvin. Right now they're just in the front yard playing and I feel like I'm excited to pick up the camera. I'm excited just to like have a video today just be like kind of what we're doing. I feel like the last few weeks have been a lot of travel and a lot of work and busy and we're just home we're just hanging out and I hope you guys are doing well okay you want to know what the biggest compliment ever is is when a friend or a neighbor for this instant is like will you help me put together an outfit what makeup would you use and I was at her house and I go I'll be back I'm gonna go into my makeup dungeon and I'm gonna pick her out a little bit of makeup and then I'm gonna give it to her she thinks I'm gonna let her use it, but I'm just gonna give it to her because I think she's getting some really special pictures done. So, I'm just gonna sit here for a minute and I'm gonna show you guys what makeup I pick for her. One thing that I love to do is to be able to help. Like, if I see someone in need or if someone wants my opinion, like, I just love that. This is my friend, she's been so good to me over the years. And so as soon as she said she had this special photo shoot, I was like, I know what I'm gonna do. I have a handful of stuff in my beauty room. I'm gonna show you what I'm gonna get her. This is uh, from Wander Beauty. They have amazing eyeshadows. Their foundation is one of my favorites. So I'm gonna give her a little eyeshadow palette. I'm gonna give her some MAC um, primer that you put under your foundation. Um, what else do I, I have a handful of things in here. 
Um, I'm gonna give her some lipstick. I love Thrive. I had an extra one on hand. And then I got this in a PR package. This is ColourPop, which I think will be really fun for her. And then a trio with blush and some bronzer. So I think that this will get her by. And a foundation. I've used this a handful of times too. Um, I'm anxious to see how I like it in the winter. It is a lightweight foundation, but it's an IT cosmetics foundation. So, I left my baby over there. I was like, you stay there, I'll be right back. And I need to go bring her some makeup. Photo shoots are so fun. Uh, Bonnie and I have done um, a few videos on, it's the Bali channel, we need to change it so it's not so confusing, but on that channel of our makeup before we do photo shoots. So if you guys wanna check out those videos, you can. All right, we have our groceries. I don't think we should get that many toy cars. Maybe we should pick two or three. One for you, Jackson, and Tommy. Okay. <gasps> no, two, three. Those all look so good. Did you get a sucker for you and Jackson? Um, uh, yeah, but they look like this. Okay. I would love to talk about three things that have made my day just really enjoyable. Nothing crazy big. I just noticed that doing those things have made my day smooth. So first was hanging out with my neighbor and helping her a little bit, getting ready for her photo shoot. And the next, I was at the grocery store with the little boys and I was so distracted, I didn't even notice but I was getting those uh, like plastic bags that you put veggies and fruit in. I was grabbing one of those and then and next to me he was in a wheelchair and he was having a hard time grabbing it. And so as I pulled one down, I opened it up and all of a sudden I see a hand reach over and he like, you know, didn't take it out of my hand, but he was like, hey, can I have that? And he like took it and I, it made, Tommy's crawling out of the tub. I'll give you more food. Um, it made me laugh. I loved it. I loved that I could be there to help someone. And so then I grabbed a few more for him. So my neighbor at the grocery store and then right now, this is one of my favorite things to do. I made dinner and then I wiped up the kitchen and now I'm giving my kids a bath, but I'm feeding them. So they're eating taco soup for dinner in the tub. Taco soup! and it keeps everything clean. It's like one of my favorite things to do. And I won't always be able to do that because they're gonna grow up big. But right now, it's really fun to do when you have babies or little toddlers or not quite toddlers, but preschoolers. So once Tommy's in bed, Calvin and I will have a little date night together. But for now, I need to feed everyone. Tommy has been crawling like mad. He is on the table. I forgot how like mobile they get. I guess Tommy's, you know, walking a little later than maybe some like of a lot of kids. When I asked a poll on Instagram, all of you guys were like, my kids walked at 12 months, 10 months. I was like, what? A handful of um, your your kids have walked much later, but Tommy's just not interested. He doesn't care. The other kids walked around 17 months, so we'll see. He, he'll walk soon. What's up? What? Tommy's butt is raw. Tommy's butt is raw? Well, what do we do when someone has a raw bum? Clean them. Clean them. Tell me, tell me, tell me, Calvin, Calvin! Okay, night, night. Good night, Tom. Look how tired he is. He's <laughs> not tired. He's not? I think he is. Good night. Ah! <laughs> oh! You want the camera? Say, oh my goodness, I got friend T. Say night night. <coughs> night night, mama. <coughs> night night, mama. <laughs> Who is ready for the best little treat? Banana, yogurt, sprinkles. Mine has coconut topping and a little bit of cherry. So instead of like an ice cream dessert, it's bananas and yogurt, but with a little, a little bit of a treat on top. Calvin and I are gonna go downstairs and eat this. Quiet, because Tommy just went to bed. Are you ready to see Toy Story 4? I'm ready to see Duke Boom. Duke Kaboom! Is that your favorite one? Yeah. Okay, we're gonna have a little movie night together. Look! <gasps> There's Toy Story 4. Are you all Disneyed out from last week? Yeah. No? Just eating your, eating your treat? Mm-hmm. All right, guys. Thank you guys so Thanks much for, for watching. Thank you for me a late night. <gasps> you are so welcome. Do you like late nights? Yep. Yeah. Good night. I love you. Love Good night, guys. We will see you guys in our next video. Bye. Side note, I just asked Calvin if he cut his shirt. 
There are cuts all over. Do you see those cuts? Yep. Why did you cut your shirt? To make it cooler. <sighs> okay, well there's that. <laughs>